Good day and welcome to a game called Please Answer Carefully. So this was a questionnaire game made in 24 hours by the developer. It's going to be a short, quick little game just because I am currently traveling right now and I am unable to use my camera. Personally, it's just because the room I'm in does not look the best on camera, so I'm just cutting that out for this video. So with that being said, let's jump on in and see what this questionnaire game is about. Question one, which of the following internet enabled devices do you currently own? Please select all that apply. I think the only thing I don't own is probably, I own a lot of electronics. Most will do at this point. On a typical weekday, about how many hours a day do you spend online? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna put that over there. It's, it's somewhere in that direction. On a typical weekday, how quickly do you respond to work-related emails or messages? Uh, honestly, I probably try my best to do it immediately, but if I'm being real, within an hour or two, sometimes I don't notice it or I'm busy and doing other things. On a typical weekday, how quickly do you respond to non-work-related emails or messages? Oh, emails, I am never responding to you. So, uh, because there's no later option. Uh, then why won't you respond to my... Excuse me? I probably am not responding because I don't know who you are, you creepy SOB. Have you ever pretended to be digitally unavailable in order to avoid communication with someone? 100%. Honestly, it's what I do a lot of the time with uh, Discord, Steam, all of that while I'm making these videos. I turn all of those on invisible so people can't see me online because then I get spammed with, hey, join my game. Hey, get over here. Hey, what are you doing? And honestly, when I'm trying to do things like this for you guys, it is really annoying and it kind of interrupts my flow and my jam. So, frequently. How much attention do you pay to online surveillance and digital tracking? Honestly, my job, I travel a lot to these countries that I know are one of the and there's not much I can do about it, so I just accept it at this point. Uh, but I'm, when I'm back home, I 100% am checking that pretty frequently. Gotta use that VPN, people. Always. Have you ever felt like you were being watched? Don't you, don't you answer for me. No one's watching me right now. You don't know where I am. I don't know. Therefore, you don't know where I am because we don't know where I don't know that I am. So, no. Actually, no, sometimes there's definitely moments where I have to look around like, hey, I have that weird sinking feeling I'm being watched. On the next page, you will be shown several statements based on your current experience. Please rate your agreement with these statements. Easy enough. I have a phone with within reach at all times. Yeah, I'm I'm pretty glued to that phone. Plus, you know, don't want people to end up stealing it because that's easy to get rid of. All my windows are locked. Yes, because I can't even open them. And well, at least in this hotel I'm in. I can recognize my neighbors' faces. Actually, yeah, uh where I live I do know who most of my neighbors are. I feel safe within my home. Oh yeah, I am locked and loaded at home. Ain't nobody bothering me in there. For quality control purposes, please select strongly agree for this question. Sure, everyone deserves a second chance no matter what they have done. I mean, with that anyway, but then why can't I come home? <laughs> um, unlock the door? I miss you so much. Mm. <laughs> oh, I don't. I am not a fan of this right now. I thought you. Don't start doing this to me. Tell me you miss me too. I'm gonna put no. Oh, it's one of those where no matter what I put, it's gonna type in for me. Dang, I was gonna put no. Just flood out no, I don't. Hello? What's going on? Are you gonna jump scare me at the end here? Where's... Oh, sneaky. Very sneaky. Okay. Huh. I, I don't know if I missed something at the very end there, but I definitely thought there was gonna be a little bit more in there. Like, maybe, like, another jump scare, another something at the end. But it, it kind of ended up abruptly. I don't know if it just bugged or... That's the answer I got. Um, 
for how quick the game was, it was advertised being a five minute game, and I took about five minutes to play it talking with y'all. It satisfied. It definitely gave me a little bit of the heebie jeebies and the parts it meant to. And I feel like if you expanded on it, it'd be a phenomenal, much deeper game. Uh, if you guys want to check it out, I'm going to go ahead and leave that below in the description for you guys to check out. If you liked my commentary for this one, please leave a like, comment, subscribe. It does help me and the channel grow. And with that being said, I hope you all have a lovely day and see you in the next video.